Welcome back all my YouTube lovers. This is Quinn Steele back and um shit. Basically, um this is my <clears throat> week four. Last week I played Rutgers and um we actually won the overtime. I didn't have enough fuck for this on me this that easy. Yeah, I, I do real bad in zone coverage. I'm not a real good zone safety right now. I like to play man or I like to oh shit. Go off of the um my man must be nervous or something. He ain't never did all this before. But I, I like to um stop the run. <coughs> but yeah, this is um my week four game. We're three and oh. Oh, got him. Safety. And like I said, I'm trying to get Heisman. I'm trying to get the Heisman. I'm trying to see. I, I mean, like I said, I heard people speculate and say things that they may hide on DB, but like I just find it just so difficult to do. Yeah. I just want to see if I can do enough to get there. Also, I want to be on um, the top of the leaderboard. I want to be the top of my leaderboard and um, by the Big East. <clears throat> and on uh, my conference and hopefully a match in, in NCAA, but them folks put up some gigantic numbers. So I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get that high up. Um, but I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be the best DB in my school and the best DB in my conference. I'm pretty sure of that. Ooh, we playing real good today. We usually don't play this good. I was probably could play in Ball State. Um, but like I want to talk to y'all about some stuff, um, just some a little stuff like, um, basically the preseason. You know, this is week four in the preseason, and um, like today is gonna be really like the last day they play all the starters, and I think next week is the week right before the Super Bowl. So next week gonna be week four, the last. Preseason games and all that, really no starters are going to play. It's just going to be really just nothing but who they were trying to cut, who they want to keep. So, um, oh, God. I always fuck that shit up, man. But, um, so today is going to be very interesting. Today, the Falcons play. And I'm just, I, I love the Falcons to death. You know, I'm from Atlanta. You know, I'm a little biased. I understand. But I actually do think they have one of the best. I think they have a top 10 team in the NFL right now. I don't think there's many folks that can beat them. Um, and I also think that they have the best wide receiver duo. If, if you think somebody else have a better duo than the Falcons, then, you know, please write um, comment, lead, let me know. But to what I've seen, Roddy White and... Julio, I think is the best duo in the NFL right now. Um, so, and then they got a, a okay, above average quarterback, Matt Ryan. He he still needs like one more year. I, I, I hope this is his breakout year. I really do. I mean, I can't say he needs one more year because he's been in the NFL for at least, I think, four years now. So, I really think this is his breakout year. Like, just, you know, you got two. You got two um, high talented wide receivers, good running back, okay defense. Uh, I, I think, yeah, I really think that they can be in the top. I mean, I think he needs just, just come on out and just do his thing this year. Also, um, last preseason, last week, I was really looking forward to seeing T.O. And T.O. impressed me with speed and getting open, but he dropped the touchdown pass. Like, where did they do that at? 
Like, come on, T.O., you did all that to get in the league to drop the first touchdown pass. Wide open, <laughs> nobody in front of you. Um, you know, age might be catching up with him. I don't know. Um, but it's all right. It just, that was the first game. Um, this week should be very interesting. So, he should have... Um, I think he should have a, a pretty good game this year. I think he's going to try to redeem himself. You know, probably me, folks, talking about him and saying that he should. So, I'm pretty sure he's going to um, do his thing. Also, um, Red and Moss didn't do too much. Um, so, I'm looking forward to, like, really seeing what they're going to do this preseason. Um, cause you know fantasy is coming up. You know I love fantasy football. Um, I play like I've been playing the last three years. Um, me and my homeboys, we all play. Um, we all you know put in a pool of money or whatever, and um, you know basically at the end of the um, season, you know you get all the money you win or whatever. But um, ooh, first pick of the season. First pick of the season, everybody got. <laughs> but um, so like you know, um, also like RG three, reality came to set in. You know, saying you know you get your first game, you want to do your best. You know, I understand, and you get. I, I ain't gonna say lucky plays, but you just do everything the right way. And you know that was the first week, and you look real excellent. Everybody looking like, oh, you're a god. Same thing with Andrew Luck. First week, he can't do no wrong. He put up staggering numbers, and you know he just he couldn't do no wrong. But last week, big difference. Last week, before showed what a real NFL defense is, threw two picks, um, and I mean he did come back and run for a touchdown and threw a long. He went back on some good drive, so you can see that he's not. Scared, or he's not, you know, just feeling like maybe he can be in the NFL because he really can't. He got a good arm. Um, his team is not that good, but he's got a straight little arm. RG3, same with him. Uh, you know, it just gotta take them reps, man. Like, folks is gonna, people are gonna start, people are gonna start um, researching you and. And playing you the way that what they see that your faults are, and you have to see your faults and you know make them your strengths. <laughs> so hopefully, you know they can him and um, RG Luck and RG can do that this week. Also, my fantasy, um, we draft next Friday, so it's gonna be very interesting. It's a lot of I got a lot of sleepers right now. Uh, I'm trying to I'm knock them down to at least five. I don't like to pick a lot of sleepers because like nine times out of ten, out of if you pick five, only two of them really gonna be some okay people. You know what I'm saying? So um, quarterbacks. I really don't know what I'm gonna go this year. How I'm gonna go with quarterback? I don't know. I don't know. My first pick gonna be a quarterback this year, like the last couple of years. My first pick will be a running back, um, and I've been doing real good. So I think um, this year, I think I'm gonna continue that. Then I'm gonna go running back. I think I'm gonna go this year though. Run, instead of running back, quarterback, I'm gonna go running back, running back, wide receiver, tight end, quarterback. Now, me going that way, my quarterback is not gonna be an elite. But I think one of my sisters is a quarterback, and I think that if he do have a good year this year, that I'm going to surprise a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? So I'm really looking forward to that. I'm really, just, I'm really looking forward to just surprising a lot of folks and, um, you know, killing them. Um, but we do, you know, you see, we go on to win this game. Um, I can't wait till I get some more time so I can start putting like, my whole games on here. But you know, I don't have that much time. And, you know, if you, if, you, if you like what I'm doing, please like, um, like it or comment, or comment in my videos. Um, please tell me who you think is the best wide receiver duo in the NFL.